and welcome to Rockingham in Northamptonshire, so often the venue for crucial moments in the British Touring Car Championship title battle. Sam Tordoff leapt to the top of the standings two weeks ago and he's going to be aiming to be in that same position when he leaves Rockingham at the end of today. Here's Louise Goodman, our own uh, Louise Goodman, pit lane reporter, about to become the first woman ever to take part in a Formula One pit stop. And there she goes, wheel comes off, well done Louise! David, how could you give all of this up? Oh, look at it, it's wonderful, isn't it? <laughs> Tonight, it's the ladies' turn to take centre stage as some of the drivers, wives and girlfriends and the occasional TV presenter join the professionals on the catwalk for the Amber Fashion event. But you must be very proud of your collection. There's some stunning clothes in here. They're all wearing bikinis. Have you just noticed? <laughs> Lewis, you have made an entire nation so proud. Just see if you can put into words for us what this victory means to you. It's, it's pretty much impossible to, to put into words. I'm so speechless. I'm here, my family's here, my dad's here. It's been such a long journey. This is the calm before the storm in Monica. I mean, it's all going to be kicking off over the next few days, during which time this is really the only way to get around, isn't it? Two wheels. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, we're going to go for a nice little ride up in the hills and take a view of Monaco from there. So, shall we go? Of course, the Formula One drivers aren't the only stars down here in the south of France at the moment. Here at the Cannes Film Festival, the Ocean's 13 premiere is the hot ticket. Guess who's bagged herself an invite? The diesel was clearly quicker. I got a 0 to 60 of 10.4. The thump in the back as you go up through the gears is great. Top speed's restricted to 155 miles an hour, but it would be closer to 200 if it was unlimited. You've had an amazing career, amazing life, really, and, and you've kept a record of it all in, yeah. the, in your scrapbooks. It's all, all in those books there. Now, the black ones are my private life, yeah. and the green ones are my racing life. Which one have you got more of? Actually, I've got a few more black ones. <laughs> I've excited right. life. Yeah, we're down in a little side garage off the Williams main garage. You can see all the uh, tyre blankets lined up here, heating up prior to the start of qualifying. We come to have a look at something that might be of interest to the technophiles amongst you. It's this brand new touch control system. This is a very intense moment for everybody. So you're suffering with dual symptoms then? You're missing us? I I'm always missing you, Louise. So where are we going now? Now I'm going to show you my big passion outside Formula One and uh, I'm going to take you with a little ride in the countryside, showing you my vineyard. Thank you very much. I think you qualify for tomorrow's race. Yes. I'm in. Mean...